Sure, Russ played better. Beal looked like his old self. And they got much needed support from Rui as the Wizards advanced to the first round of the playoffs. And it was great to see Russ smiling after the game and having fun with the TNT crew compared to how he looked during the Boston game like he hadn't slept in the Holiday Inn Express in years. And so I know there are things in the NBA nobody wants to talk about. The seedy underbelly of pro basketball, the naked and ugly truth, that is Robin Lopez's hook shot. Now, I know he shot almost 64% of them this season and that it was instrumental in the run that ended the game last night in the second quarter. But basketball is supposed to be jazz mixed with ballet. But with Robin Lopez, we get emo crossed with calliope music mixed in with some 60s German experimental synth pop. If we're lucky, he just makes one turn over his left shoulder before catapulting this thing flat to the rim. He gets the ball out away from his body really early before jumping off both feet to push this in with just a little, barely teeny tiny flick of the wrist. I think one reason this looks so awkward is the left arm goes up to ward off the defender. When Kareem did it, he jumped off of one foot and had the left arm at chest level. Lopez is practically doing a touchdown signal to start and has to twist all the way around to get it to release. If we're unlucky, then we get a whole bunch of step-throughs and whirling before the hook. Everyone knows it's coming, and you can practically hear the audience groan as the hair goes flying, the feet are sliding all over the place, he contorts into a crescent moon shape. I swear he lost control of it for a second on the way up, but then somehow displays nice touch. In the Boston game, he tries a fake with his left arm going up. Robert Williams just stands there saying, dude, just get it over with. And he gets sideways. There's that left hand slapping at Williams' arm. The right arm is also in front of Lopez's body and set it straight over his shoulder. And yet, I mean, that left arm fake, coupled with the ball fake to the ground, okay. And then an arm angle with almost no wrist flick. I mean, he pushed this mascot down to the ground smoother than he shoots his hook shots. Oh, and then he uncorked one lefty. And it's like, what are we doing here? I caught another lefty he tried earlier this year, and his legs fly apart, the arm is even more out in front than his right, and oh, missed it by that much. Not sure what's happening with the right leg kick out on release here, but there must be some muscle chain connection, I guess. He tried an off foot hook here, and hey, I respect the hustle. And this one was a doozy. Are you ever in the shower and in such deep thought you forget which parts you've already washed? I think that happened here. Lopez loses track of which way he meant to spin, adds a couple of extra in for good measure anyway, before heaving in at the rim. But hey, I can't deny he hits these a lot more than he misses. But as my son says on his Discord, can we get an oof up in this chat? If you like this, hit that subscribe button and I'll be back for more every day of the playoffs. You win?